clothes, dare I say, on taxes. And you know what? Every time there's been a vote by the Liberal government on the HST, Ms. Albanese has been there to stand up in her place and vote for it. But you know what? When we had a vote to take the HST off hydro bills, a vote put forward by the NDP, uh, Ms. Albanese conveniently sculpted away and didn't show up for the vote. Is that the kind of leadership you want on Queen's part? Shame on you! Alright, thank you for the question. Next question. Shame on you! Please, let's show some decorum. Right. I've been asked by my technical advisor to ask the questions. I was, I was absent, yes, I was absent for five weeks from Queen's Park because of an operation, okay? And that is not something to bring up. If we can calm down, please. Thank you. Okay, ma'am, if you're ready with your question. Um, I, I'd like to go back to the ARL question. Um, I, my name is Sarah Marvardlinski. I'm a co-chair of the Western Community Coalition. My co-chair is actually sitting behind me, Carla Penelia, and uh, we're very concerned by this brochure. I got both of these, one in my mailbox and one at work, and it says you champion your causes to achieve um, the new stop in Western for the Air Rebellion Link of the Go expansion. The stop in Western for the for the ARL was championed by over 2,500 people who live in the community, who fought long and hard for many years to get that stop because it was going to bypass our community. That's how it became Blue 22. It's now really Blue 25 or 26. They've only shaved off three or four minutes from the time because of the extra stop in Weston and the stop in in Dundas West, which was not there at the beginning. It was actually a stop at Woodbine. We actually got that stop taken out and we'll probably go back in eventually, but we did that as a community. Not you, not you. So I, I'm actually defended, not just as a community member, but as a business owner, that to, for, yes, the, how can she write stuff like this and lie to the community? No, this is a lie to say that you achieved this. You did not achieve this. You need to achieve this. Go ahead, Laura. Go ahead to that one. I am not taking away anything from the community. I have been working with the community and fighting with the community to achieve the same things that the community wanted. And that is a stop and lesson, covering the trains, creating a new go station, and fighting for electrification. I continue to fight for that, and I fought with the community. The new go station was already in place. Before you were with the community. Yeah. That's a lie. Don't show Please don't try to calm down. The debate only works if we don't yell and scream. It's a lie. You answer. I'll remind folks again. The new GO station in Weston was announced before the 2007 election. I'm proud. I'm proud of the fact that I've been involved with this issue since 2004. But the person who deserves a lion's share of the credit for working so diligently on this issue over the past 10 or 11 years, I'm proud to say is my friend, the new NDP Member of Parliament for this area, Mike Smith.